Hey, this is Ken Allen, and just wanted to talk to you briefly about a new plugin from Alex Goad and Brian McConaughey, uh, which is called Ultimate Video Curator. And what this plugin does is just easily add content to your WordPress sites from uh, from YouTube. So you can uh, go out to YouTube, you can do the searches from within the control panel, and then create create your post. Um, you can also download the videos to your server for uh, self-hosted video video as well. Um, this is inside the uh, the control panel. You can see there's an area here on Ultimate uh, Video Curator which allows you to do several things. Search, uh, shows your posted videos, save videos, downloaded. You can set up uh, Google Alerts and uh, your settings. So. If I want to come in here and, and do a, uh, a search, let's see, it's kind of cold in Florida, so it kind of makes me think of skiing, which we don't have here, of course, but um, you have several filters that you can uh, that you can use for it. And so if I um, click on on the uh, ski racing, you can see there's a bunch of videos that are going to come up. Um, this allows you to do several things. Once you know, once the videos come up, you can uh, click on here and you can search on other videos by the same user you know, if you like a particular user, and then select their videos, or you can come back. Um, you can download the video and. Click on downloading. You know, again, what that'll do is go to the self-hosted server, and you know, along with the video thumbnail, that uh, when you do it that way, can uh, definitely help your your rankings. Uh, and the other thing you can do is you can uh, save save for later. So if you select that, then uh, it'll uh, select that video, and then you can add it to your site at a at a later time. Or the other thing you can do is you can create a new post. And if you uh, selected create a new post, and that's going to bring you into a screen where you've got uh, several more options. Uh, you can select if you want it to autoplay the video, uh, or if you want to hide the controls so that the uh, user isn't able to uh, have any control over, over the video playing. You have a content section, and here the uh, YouTube content is brought in from uh, the description in YouTube. Uh, if you have a spinner, you can uh, select it to, to spin the YouTube content. You could also add add your own content down here. Um, what was this called? The uh, Red Bull. Skills Tournament. Let's add some content real quick. You can also spin the spin the content that you're adding to it. Now you have some options for the curation so if you want to have uh, have it part of uh, where it's coming from a feed you can uh, select that uh, you can see also some related videos uh, if you have a feed set up then you can uh, select that here you have uh, some post settings if you want to put tags if you want to uh, schedule when you want it to actually post, uh, you, know, you can select which category that you want it to go into, and here you can select if there's comments on YouTube. You can have it generate a random number of of uh, posts or comments that were on the uh, on the video. If you want to upload an image to go with your with the video, so if you have your own image, you could upload it, or you can just select a thumbnail, which is kind of based on uh, what's on here. And 
You can also just click on create post content. And so you can see how quickly it created it. And we go in and we can view the post. So here you can see it on uh, on your site. You can see that uh, comments are already uh, posted on your site as well. So you've got some good comments there. Here if you've uh, downloaded you can go to your saved videos. These are the ones that were uh, that were saved. You can add a group up here. So you can just uh, create a group. Well, here you can select. Uh, the group that you want. You've got bulk actions, where you can select a bunch of them to go to your uh, to the group. So if you want to move all these uh, videos, you can just click that and oh, I guess we need to select them. But and then you just add them. Here's the downloaded videos. No, I haven't downloaded any yet. And the other place is the uh, Google Alert. So if you have a Google Alert feed, you can you can add that into here. We have uh, the templates down here. It's just a default one. But uh, if you wanted to go in, you can ed edit that. So that'll just really be the default settings on your videos. And other settings and here's where you would put in your your uh, plug-in settings for your your spin your spinner so that's a that's a quick uh, walkthrough of the ultimate video curator and like I said it looks like it looks like a pretty good and pretty easy way to add videos to your site to increase your user engagement uh, if you want more information about this plugin just go ahead and click the link below